Hello, my name is Nolan. You could call me Nolan for short. Thank you, Nolan. How are you today? Good. My name is Bilu. Bilu work with a lots of women and even the little boys. And uh, I teach a traditional chant, you know, and I teach them the Palawan uh, men uh, or boys uh, a traditional dance, and they do dance very good. Do you know what this is? A house. This is a house. The name of this is Bai. And then uh, the men, they are the one that makes this kind of uh, building a bai. And they write that they draw the pictures of the, you see this? Stingray and the sharks and the fish. And do you know the roosters? Yes. <laughs> and then, you know what this means in Palau? They're supposed to send a message to, to other men that there's going to be a meeting in a bay. So that's why they put the roosters in there. And uh, the men show that they are very strong like sharks. That's why they print the picture of sharks. And this is made of pandanas leaves. Does Guam have a building like this? Oh, they do, okay. So in Palau, this is a place for, women, for men to get together and have their meetings. Would you like to see some pictures? Yes. Okay. I'll show you, see the, the boys? I'm teaching them how to husk the coconut and how to eat the coconut. So coconut in Palau is leaves. Do you like the ocean? Yes. You know, Guam and Palau have beautiful ocean, a lot of fish, and uh, look at this. That's the red snapper, and it looks like the, the color of the, the, we call it sea fans. Okay, do you like that picture? Okay. I'd also like red. Do you know what this one is? Turtle. That's a turtle. Okay, and look at this fish. They like to swim with the turtles. It looks like swordfish. Uh-huh. You know, you're very smart. What do you think this picture here is? Duk, duk. That's a nautilus. Oh. Nautilus, and they like to live deep down in the water. What do you think that one is? Stingray. You are very smart. It is a stingray. You said you like red fish and a pink, and these are sea anemones, it's a, and these are clownfish, and they're little fish, and they like to swim in, in those. Um, Alemonis. They live in there because so they could get protected. Yes, you are right. So what do you think Palau and Guam have in common, like the same? Fish. We have fish, you're right. And ocean. Ocean, you're right. Coconuts. Sure, we have a lot of coconuts in Guam and Palau. That's why I was teaching those guys how to husk the coconut and how to eat it. Anything else? We also have the same of these houses. Okay, very good. And then we have our own language. Guam have their language, Palau have their language, and, and so many things uh, that uh, we have alike uh, because we are island people. So this is little book, it says Sa'ali, that means my friend. And then it's English, and it's in Palawan. So okay, you can read the story, and then you can learn to speak the Palawan. I want you to learn to speak my language. Would you like to do that? All right. So I give you this book, and this is my present to you. Thank you. I like meeting with you. It's it's good I'm becoming your friend. Don't forget to can come and to Palau and swim and stay with me. Thank you. Okay. Thank you, Nolan. I have something for you too. Ooh. It's 
It's called Haichu. Thank you so much. Mmm. This is really good. Thank you so much, Nolan. You're welcome. Okay. <laughs> Subscribe to Nihi Kids on YouTube to watch the full episode.